Welcome to the UC Zone. I wanted to make a video today about my Sportsman Gen 4000. This is a generator we got after Hurricane Michael and it has helped us out on some good times. Today we are going to do an oil change. I wanted to do this video after searching on YouTube and not being able to find a video. So today I thought I would make one for you. As I mentioned before, this is a Sportsman GEN 4000. It is a portable gasoline generator producing 4000 surge watts and 3500 running watt. It is a four stroke engine producing 212 cc's. It has one 12 volt DC outlet, four 120 volt AC outlets, and one 120 volt RV outlet. It holds up to 3.6 gallons of fuel and can run up to 10 hours with 50% load time. The tools needed today to do this procedure will be 18 fluid ounces of small engine oil. Uh, it, this thing actually holds 18.6, so I will need to dump a little bit out of this other one to top it off. Uh, you will need an oil pan for the old oil. And you will need a 12 millimeter wrench to, un to loosen the drain plug for the oil. As you can see, the drain plug is right here for the oil. So we will begin by sliding the oil pan into place and loosening and loosening so after using this tool to loosen it we can now begin To drain it. As you can see now, the oil is just about fully drained out into the, the drain pan. I will come over here, wipe out this access here. It's, there's still going to be little bits, but I'm going to go ahead and put this back in. Right. Tighten it down a little bit. Let's first do it. Ooh, about drop that in there. Tighten that. Good by hand. And we'll come back and torque it. Oh, get your tool in the oil. Come back here. Give it a little tweak. Make sure it's nice and secure. And that's the end of that step. With the oil fill plug removed, we will now also remove the old oil pan with old oil. Next, we'll take our trusty funnel, place it inside, take our premium small engine oil, open it as so, and we will begin the procedure of adding in the new oil. As a much lighter creamier color compared to the oil that we removed from the engine and we will slowly add it in all right so that is the 18. however this needs still a 0.6 ounce We'll go ahead and add a little bit of this. 
Now, let's top off the gas and see if it'll fire up. Well, we have the oil topped off. We got the gas topped off. Now, let's see if we can start it. Again, turn the fuel on. Flip that on. We want to warm it up. And we want to close it to start. Let's see if we get a couple to get it primed up. successfully changed the oil in the generator. Thank you for joining me on this uh, <clears throat> video today. Um, if you would, please check out my travel video over here. And uh, remember to like, share, and subscribe. And uh, stay with the UC Zone and we'll maybe turn this into a uh, series of videos on self-help how to do shit. I'm learning how to do shit myself. So. Maybe we can all learn together. All right. Take care. Bye.